Hey everybody, Miss Thompson here. I'm going to show you how to, to solve today's warm-up using a ratio table. So first I'll read the warm-up and then we'll solve using a ratio table. You want to save up enough money to buy a new pair of shoes that cost $150. You decide that you will put $7 in your piggy bank every week from your allowance to buy the shoes. If you currently have $45 in your bank, how long will it take you to save enough money? Explain your reasoning. All right, so let's set up our ratio table. I'm just going to set up a table like this, divide it in half, and then we'll call this um, money on top. Um, and it doesn't matter the way you set it up. Money could be on the bottom or the top. And then this one's going to be weeks, okay? So that's how I'm going to set up my ratio table. So what I'm going to have to do is come up with a way that I'm going to get to $150 over here at this very end. So what I could do is say that I started off with $45, but then in then the first week, in the first week, so I'm going to add one week, I'm going to save $7 to my account, which means it would put me 52 here in week one. After one week, I'll have $52 because 45 plus 7 is 52. Okay. Then the next week, I'm going to save another $7. So I'm going to plus one down here. I'm going to get two weeks. And when I add 52 plus 7, I'm going to get 59. And so on and so forth until you get to this $150. And it's going to equal, when you, when you really work it out, it's going to take you 15 weeks to save that $150. Now I could set it up a different way. I could just eliminate the $45 and see how much I have to save because remember, the question's asking you how long will it take you to save enough money to get to that $150. So in order to, to figure out how much I have to save, I'm going to have to take that $150 that I want for my shoes and I'm going to have to take away what I already have. So I'm going to have to save $105. If I set up a ratio table that way, it's a little bit easier because I can start with money here again and weeks here again. I'm going to save $7 every week. And that's going to be a little bit easier, but I know that I have to get to this 105 at the end in my end column. And that's going to, if I keep working it out, it's going to take me 15 weeks.